Hey everybody, it's Paige and welcome to another weekly vlog. I filmed one of these a couple of weeks ago and you guys seem to really enjoy it. I had a lot of fun filming it and I loved seeing your comments on that video and just kind of like giving you guys a little bit more of like an inside peek on my regular day to day life. So I figured we would do it again this week. Happy Monday. It's actually Monday night. It's like nine o'clock. We are starting off this week very weird so we were in orlando this past weekend we planned to come home yesterday but then we got like through downtown and then i realized i left my laptop at Allie and corey's house so um yeah we had to go back and get it and then it was late and it was raining there was bad weather so we ended up just staying the night again and we left this afternoon um the drive was pretty seamless and then we got home had dinner streamed some fortnite but now i'm gonna sit down and watch teen wolf i thought i would film an intro to the vlog there's a couple of things i wanted to show you before i get to watching tv um but yeah if you guys are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy and let's get into the vlog so i wanted to show you guys this package this is a very special package if you guys are fans of the vampire diaries you need to see this so my friend kristen has her own business it's called j sky clothing co she did a tvd inspired launch and this is the pr package it is so freaking cool literally these will be the first link in the description box you guys we've got this super cute packaging j sky clothing co we've got all of the characters names elena stefan caroline tyler jeremy bonnie alaric etc and then this is the complete collection so you can actually purchase the pr package which is this right here um or you can purchase everything individually for the most part these are already available look at how cute this like card is um i will have their social medias as well as their website linked down below you guys can use code page for 10 percent off so here's everything in the collection we've got two shirts two mugs and a bunch of stickers these stickers are so cool there's character stickers so you've got like jeremy um you've got bonnie and elena stefan and damon and elena there's like little quotes hello brother damon we love him um there's like a blood bag that says mystic falls hospital a bonnie sticker clock tower literally anything that you can think of so freaking cute i love the stickers and then these are the cups these are like metal coffee cups and this one says hello brother and it has damon let me know in the comments if you're team da damon or team stefan um but there's that one and then this one says mystic grill so it's like you could literally like look like you're at mystic grill and i'm actually planning a trip to mystic grill in a couple of weeks which i'm really excited about and then there's two shirts her shirts are the softest shirts this one has damon on it this is a short sleeve shirt we love damon i am definitely team damon and then oh wait no no no. this is the long sleeve i am so sorry <laughs> this is the long sleeve on the sleeve it says hello brother super cute and then this is the short sleeve it has both of them on it so we've got stefan and damon and then on the back it actually says it's okay to love them both which is so cute and i definitely do love them both but I do love Damon more. <laughs> um, so yeah, definitely check out J Sky Clothing Co. Her stuff is so cute. If you love Vampire Diaries or you know someone that loves Vampire Diaries, this is like a perfect gift or present for yourself. And again, you guys can use code PAGE for 10% off. Also, while I was in Orlando, I did a little bit of shopping. We went to the Morphe store and I got to use code PAGE for 10% off in person. It was so cool. I don't know. I just like can't believe it. <laughs> I went with Allie and Corey and Jarvis and our friend Caleb and we were there and we just were like, hi, like, can we use code page? <laughs> I'm literally saving this receipt forever. Um, oh wait, that's not even the side that says page. There it says page for 10% off. So freaking cool. So I'm going to film a haul this week of everything that I bought. And then we also went to Barnes and Noble, which 
if you guys saw my last vlog you know that I have been loving reading recently so I picked up some books so let me show you what I have just to update you guys this is what I'm currently reading this is beach read by Emily Henry I also already have this book which is it ends with us by Colleen Hoover I have heard so many incredible recommendations for this book so I definitely want to read this one soon um i've read verity by colleen hoover it was fantastic i 10 out of 10 would recommend um so this is what i'm currently reading i have this and then these excuse the mess over here we have some new books so this is called the wife between us this was recommended well not to me but i saw it on youtube um the same person that inspired me to read verity also inspired me to read this so i picked this one up i think it's like a psychological thriller it says uh gone girl and girl on the train like that kind of vibe so maybe a little spooky then i picked this one up this one's called we are liars this was in like the tiktok section so they had like a table dedicated to books that have gone viral on tiktok so I thought I would pick that one up and then Allie is actually a big reader and she recommended both of these books to me so we've got The City of Bones and Vampire Academy so I definitely want to read these both of these are part of like super long series um they're from two different series though but they both have quite a few books in the series so I'm really excited I don't know really much about either of these books um or these so I've got lots of read for the upcoming weeks I'm excited I'm gonna go ahead pick out a face mask put it on sit down relax watch some Teen Wolf with my friend Kristen from far away long distance friendship over here um, watch some Teen Wolf and just kind of call it for the night and yeah let's go pick out a face mask and then I will see you guys tomorrow we have a winner so I'm gonna go ahead put this on watch some TV and I'll see y'all tomorrow Hey guys and happy Tuesday I feel like I never know how to like intro the next day like happy Monday happy Tuesday happy Wednesday <laughs> anyway it's Tuesday we are currently at the UPS store I am picking up some packages from my PO box I also have some PR packages at my parents house which is like close to my PO box so we're picking up all the packages today I'll show you guys the ones that were sent to my PO box like I'll open them up for you um, but I'll save the other ones for a PR unboxing but yeah I feel super awkward I'm sitting alone in the car filming there's people walking all around me I feel like for being like for this being my job <laughs> I get so nervous like filming in public oh my god that scared me he's here with the packages that you scared me so bad I did. yeah I was just talking about how nervous I was sitting in the car <laughs> filming myself do you want to say hello to the vlog hi vlog how are you good how's it going good how you living wow What's going on in your life? Is everything okay? Can I help you with anything? <laughs> You're so good at this. <laughs> so we have a couple of packages back there from my P.O. box and now we're gonna go pick up the other ones from my parents' house. That's a good girl. I miss you. Oh, Bean. Look at you. Oh, you're such a pretty girl. Yeah. Hey, Miss Bean. 
Thank oh, you. Oh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> this looks like a chicken leg. Oh, hi, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing they removed the other package types. So that was everything that was at my P.O. box. Now I have to get ready and film some main channel videos. I'm gonna have to crank them out, try to get one edited and uploaded today since I've been trying to upload five days a week. Four to five, I really wanna make it five, but it's definitely like, it's a little bit of a transition. <laughs> I'm trying to post Monday through Friday. So I'm gonna go do my hair, film, edit, and I will check in with you guys a little bit later. Hey guys, it is Wednesday. We are currently in my makeup room because we have a little project. We're gonna be doing some makeup reorganization and I'm excited for what I have planned. We're gonna be reorganizing all of my Jaclyn Cosmetics products because I've ran out of space where um, they previously were. So I'm gonna show you guys what we have in store. So currently I have all of my Jaclyn Cosmetics products in these drawers which sit right next to me when I'm filming but these are just kind of like half organized but everything is still like piled on top of other things. Same with this drawer like it's kind of organized but like kind of not. And then I also have more of her products over here. We've got lip products, the Bougie Rouge collection. So all of this is going to be moving into my container store containers that I've had here for months and haven't put anything inside of them because I cannot figure out what to put in them. I don't know if that sentence made sense, but you get what I'm saying. Um, so I have these containers. I got them from the container store. These are like really popular containers. I also bought the dividers that you can put inside of them. So we have like smaller compartments. So this bottom drawer has four little compartments. This is the biggest one. This one has, I guess like six compartments and then these just have the one like large compartment um, these are meant for like shoes and sweaters and shirts and stuff but I figured this is a little bit more space than what I'm working with now and I think it would look really cute and I like keeping my Jaclyn Cosmetics products together so let's go ahead and get to organizing Okay, so I believe these are all of my Jaclyn Cosmetics products, so um, I'm going to just kind of start playing around. I'm not really sure where I'm going to put what. Um, obviously, there are like palettes that are larger and like these larger powders and stuff that would probably do better in these larger drawers here and like I'm guessing the lip products will end up going up top, but I just want to have everything in one place. I want it to be organized and look cute. So let's see if we can accomplish that. Wow guys, we did it. I am so 
happy with how this looks. It is so freaking cute. I love having all of my Jaclyn Cosmetics products on display. You can kind of see them like back here. It's all organized. We have like old discontinued stuff, her newer releases. Oh, I love it so much. So cute. I will say that it is kind of like high up for me. Like this is like my eye level. And so I do have to like I can't see down into the drawers. I would have to like pull the drawer out. Also, these don't feel like the most sturdy containers and like I'm kind of scared that this is like too heavy. So like I'm super careful when I open and close these just because I don't want like anything to break. So yeah, they look super cute. I wish they were sturdier though. I feel like they make a lot of noise and they like the whole thing shakes, but all of this makeup is cleaned and put away. Now we have this, um, which I'm probably just going to do this off camera because, um, yeah, we just, you know, organized the Jaclyn products together, but, um, I do need to get this done. <laughs> um, it's crazy how fast the surface gets messy. I literally just cleaned it and now we're here. It's been a couple days since I put this stuff here and more things just add and collect but anyway i actually finished another diamond painting today i'm so happy it's the one i've been working on for the last few weeks so now i have to pick a new one i have two to choose from so let's go in there and pick one out and just kind of like start working on it i already spent some time diamond painting today so i won't be doing it for too long but i do think it would be fun to officially start my next diamond painting with you guys here's the one that I just finished so pretty I absolutely loved the colors in this one super cute bouquet of flowers but it is time to move on to a new one these are my two new ones that I haven't opened yet it's gonna be hard to see what they're supposed to be but this is like a little pink building with like a bicycle and some flowers and then this one is upside down, but <laughs> this is another like vase with a bunch of flowers in it. I really like the floral um, diamond paintings. I think they're fun. Um, but since we just did, sorry, it was out of focus. Since we just did a floral, how about we switch it up? I mean, the bike has floral in it too, but we'll just kind of change things up and we'll do this one now. So I'm going to clear my workspace of my old diamonds and then crack into the new one. While I'm doing this, I am watching Nick A30's Fortnite stream. So here's what the diamond painting looks like. Um, it looks cute, like from far away. It does look cute. I feel like it looks, um, I don't know. It doesn't look as good in person as I thought it was going to. So I don't know if this one um, isn't like as good of quality or is, I, I don't know. It just doesn't look very detailed like in the blank um diamond painting but we'll see how it goes i just order my diamond paintings from amazon i know i've mentioned that before but i just like search like pink floral diamond painting and then i look through the ones i look for ones that have good reviews and then i order them they're usually about like 10 to 15 dollars a piece that's just like what i've done so far i've completed four of them so this is my fifth one and i don't know they're just like lots of the same like symbol in big chunks which can get kind of boring so the more detailed it is the better but we'll see we'll see how it goes
Hey guys, can you believe that it is already Thursday? Because I can't. This whole week has been so weird to me. I think it's because we got home from Orlando on Monday and I was thinking that we were going to be coming home Sunday and then everything just got thrown off after that. But it is Thursday. Jarvis and I just had lunch. We had breakfast for lunch as you guys saw and now I need to film and I need to film a few videos. I'm in my filming room now. I have to go do my hair because the curls have just like fallen out from yesterday. Um, but I'm watching some Fortnite streams. I'm watching Nikkei 30. I love Cypher PK is my favorite Fortnite streamer. <laughs> but I also have been watching Nikkei 30 for the last like week, like this week pretty much. Um, and I really like his content too. He's family friendly, which is great. Um, but anyway, <laughs> um, I'm gonna go do my hair today. We are filming um, a testing new drugstore makeup video. As you guys can see, I have a bunch of new products to try out. And then I also have a Morphe haul to film. So I got some goodies at the Morphe store. I think I mentioned that a couple of days ago. So I have that to film. And then the drugstore makeup video to film. I really need to clean my brushes soon because they're pretty much all dirty. So... I need to do that. I'll probably, it usually takes me a couple days to clean my brushes, honestly, because I have so many and obviously they have to dry. So I usually like wash as many as I can and let them dry overnight just so that they're good to go the next day. So I might start that process tonight. We will see. But anyway, let's go fix this hair. I'll just show you guys the after. So here is the before and here is the after i just wanted to add a little bit of extra curl in my hair i do need to kind of like run my fingers through it to make it look a little bit more messy or like natural um but yeah i just take my flat iron and kind of like twist it through my hair and pull down and it gives me like messy curls so now i'm gonna film I will check in with you guys a little bit later, um, but I have to get to work. Hey guys, happy Friday. I'm with Jarvis. Hi. <laughs> Why is it so awkward? <laughs> um, we're at Marshall's. We're stopping in here. I have to go to an engagement party tomorrow. Well, we have to go to an engagement party tomorrow, but I have to find an outfit. So we're at Marshall's. Um, hopefully I can find something. And then we're going to go make a special stop at Crumble Cookies. I'm so excited. I've heard special nothing stop. but good things. <laughs> um, and I heard the flavors that they have this week are like really good. So I'm excited. Are you excited? I, I didn't even... I just know they have cookies there. I yeah, I like have seen it all over social media for the last like two weeks and that's it. And then it's in Jacksonville. There's one in Jacksonville. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'm just like behind the times, but I'm excited. Mm -hmm. So we're going to head into Marshall's. Let's go. And we think Nikki's here. Yeah, I think my mom is here. I think we parked right <laughs> next to my mom. <laughs> so we'll see if she's in there. It wasn't planned. No. <laughs> we're sneaking up on Nikki. She's going to be so confused. <laughs> Ma'am, do you have a silver wrap for? It's getting towed. <laughs> my heart. Oh my god. I saw your car and I was like, I think that's Nikki's car. We got you. Crazy. Oh my god. Oh my god. My heart. Sorry. We just got our crumble cookies from crumble cookies <laughs> um this location is at beach and hodges if you're from jacksonville i think this is 
the only one in Jacksonville, at least that I know of. So we did the four um, cookie box and it's so cute. Uh, there's like little tablets and you can just like order there. Um, and we got the, I think this was caramel apple. Is that what that one was? Something like caramel apple. This one was like cinnamon fry bread. We got a basic um, sugar cookie here. Did you see that? What? One of those things just popped. I, I heard it. It just like flew. This is the cotton candy one. I heard something pop. It, it flew out of the Wait. box like <laughs> down here. I was so confused. That's so weird. Um, They're nice and warm. So I'm really excited to try these. We'll do a taste test when we get home. We are at home now with our crumble cookies. We're gonna go ahead and do a little taste test. So we have Caramel apple, I think is what that one is. Um, did I already say this? I think I did. Mm -hmm. This is like a cinnamon one, sugar cookie, and cotton candy. So um, I don't know how we should go about this. Maybe a fork? Well, I don't know if I like that. Tastes good. Oh, you're just gonna bite it? Oh, okay. Mmm. That one's way better. Mm -hmm. I think this one, it was like cinnamon fried bread or dough. Not a fan. Mm -mm. Oh. That one's not that good. There's like no flavor in this mm -mm. thing. Cotton candy, <laughs> which is huge. My camera battery is gonna die. It's so good mm. and greasy and sugary. Holy. Jeez. My fingers are like <gasps> caked in oil. Yeah, they're like Pop Rocks, kind of. They're not really Pop Rocks, but they're kind of like Pop Rocks. It's like it's freeze-dried Dippin' Dots. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's probably what That it is. is so sweet. That's like insanely sweet. They're so, that was so like greasy. <laughs> okay, the, the, the caramel rocks. apple one is the best. That one was so good. All right, guys, so this is gonna be the end to my second ever weekly vlog. Today is Saturday, I just got done getting ready. We have an engagement party to go to, so um, we're about to head out, but I wanted to close out the vlog. I will be posting this tomorrow on Sunday. I have to edit it. I have done like no editing, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my vlog. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. Anything that you guys wanna see in my upcoming weekly vlogs, any video ideas, any like, anything at all just leave a comment down below i love you guys so much i hope you have a wonderful day and i will see you in the next one bye